<laughs> on the world spins fine on her own. Yeah. We're at Silver Springs. Yeah, it is uh, June 12th, 2021. And this is a state park. It used to be an attraction. Mm -hmm. And now it's a state park. In Florida. So, <laughs> I'm wondering if one day Disney World will become a state park. Oh yeah, can you imagine that? <laughs> Two dollar admission, guys. Two dollars! <laughs> All right, so what we're here to wow. do, we're not going to walk today. We're going to paint on these cards, yeah. these blank cards. Exactly. For people at the church that are in, not in the hospital necessarily, but they're mm -hmm. sick. Or something's going on with them. Yeah, they need some kind of cheering up. So at St. John Lutheran Church. Cheering up. I'm just, cheering I'm just, up. I'm just thinking, you know, <laughs> we're going to paint something cheery. Yeah. Right? So that's why we came here because this is a, this is a beautiful place. It's gorgeous. And the last couple of cards we did, we did uh, paintings from photographs uh -huh. or from our minds. Yeah. In the case of Arvin. <laughs> so we thought, why don't we do a plain air mm -hmm. paintings? We only have five to do, right? Yeah, just five. Well, it's always an odd number. Have you noticed that? Yeah. Oh. Yeah, I have. I've noticed that. So you get to do three and I get to oh, do two. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, last time... We split them in, we split one in half. Yeah, yeah, we did. Anyway, so, so we'll lots of activity on the river here, which is kind of cool. People on uh, those paddle boards that they stand up on. Yeah, and there's a jet ski out there. And um, uh, go ahead. We see the Silver Springs glass bottom boats and also the uh, glass bottom jungle cruise boats. It's a longer trip uh, down the river than the glass bottom boats. And they it didn't always have a glass bottom on that boat. No, now no. it does. Yeah. So they retrofitted it. Yeah, that's pretty cool, so too. So that gives me an idea. Okay. <laughs> Why are you going to retrofit something? My car. <laughs> I mean, couldn't I put a glass bottom on the car? Sure you could. Ah, you could do that. Why you never not? know what's underneath. This way you can see it. Exactly. <laughs> All right, so if we walk, we're not even sure if we're going to walk with this video, but we're going to show yeah. you the progress as we do these paintings. Yep. Uh, and also we're going to show you what's out there. So yeah. I'm going to turn this camera around and I... I a lot see, of activity I out there. I see some stuff that you might want to see. So let me turn the camera around <laughs> and we'll begin painting. The world spins fine on her own, yes. The world spins fine on her own. Okay, I started mine with complementary colors. It looks weird. It looks weird right now because of that. I don't know if it's going to work with gouache. But we'll see. We're experimenting. Yeah. Whoops. We are. I was taking a video of the squirrel. And then I was going to take one of you. Oh, okay. So I'm going to do my normal stuff now. So okay. I got the uh, complementary colors on. <laughs> now I'm going to do the actual colors. And I've never actually done this before. <laughs> with, not with gouache. But what I'm yeah. going to do, go try, using the gouache. Yeah, I used the gouache first as a watercolor. And now I'm going to use it as an opaque color. Nice. All right, and that's the scene out there. I know it doesn't look like it now, but that's what I've seen. <laughs> Hopefully. <laughs> there it is. And there's that squirrel. He's waiting on you. Yeah, baby. Hello, Robin. <laughs> Hello. Now I'm painting the real colors. <laughs> I just think it's so pretty. <laughs> It's still the blocking in part, part of it all. The blocking in part. <laughs> all right, the camera's on you. Let me see what you got going on there. Okay, that's what I got going on. Oh, you, oh, you got the fence in there. Yeah. See, I, like I, I chose to not put the fence. Oh, okay. But, but yours is so pretty. I might put the fence in my next one. <laughs> I'm yeah, not sure. We got a few to do here. Actually, yeah, we got five to do. Yeah. Oh, let me switch the angle here and get some of these canoe guys. Okay. Canoe people. They got their own private boat. Yeah, they do. Their pontoon boat. That's what's great about this place. You got your private boat. You can bring it up here, but you cannot dock. You cannot dock, even if you are an MD. Exactly. You cannot dock. All right. There we go. I got to get back to my painting. Yes, you do. I got a lot to go. A long way to go. Oh, that's a pretty picture right there.
Mm -hmm. All right, we are painting. Yes, we are. And Plain we got our two. Painting. Cherry Ray, three, two, one. Go. Ta da! Ta -da. <laughs> Both looking at the same thing, two different styles. Yeah. Bring yours close to the camera, then I'll do mine. Okay. Look at that. Look, oh, you featured the fence. Yeah, I like the fence. Ah. And I featured your turn. the water. Oh, that's so beautiful. It looks like it's moving. It is moving. Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. <laughs> I think so. it's great. So we're going to now yeah. do the really real reason we came here, which was to have lunch. Yeah. <laughs> so we have a cooler. Yes, we do. And we're going to break out the sandwiches. Yep. But we're going to turn off the camera. Okay. While we're eating, I'll show you some pictures. All right, so we're in Silver Springs. We yeah. want, we're gonna tell you a little bit about Silver Springs. For those of you who live in the area, just fast forward, because you've heard all this before. Mm -hmm. So, oh, you say I know a lot. I'm gonna tell you what I know. Okay. Silver Springs <laughs> State Park <laughs> is now what used to be Silver Springs, the attraction, plus what used to be the Silver River State Park. Exactly. So it's, it was two things. Now it's one thing. That's right. And the Silver River State Park has uh, camping. They have cabins. They have a beautiful, beautiful <laughs> museum there filled with Florida history and fossils, <laughs> dinosaur fossils. And they also have what they call a cracker village. And those are authentic crackers, uh, crackers, <laughs> saltines, Ritz, <laughs> no. all kinds of crackers, Lance crackers. <laughs> Authentic cracker houses. Uh, the houses are really the authentic ones. They're not reproductions. You've got a church there. You've got a school. You've got a farmhouse there. There are a few other buildings. It's uh, really, really nice. So this was a happening place when it was... Uh, I, I wish I could tell you what years. you think it was the 30s and the 40s? That's when it was yeah. really, really popular. Yeah. Before Disney World. Right, exactly. Yeah. It rolled over to the 50s and then the early 60s. Well, that's right. Then, yeah, Disney would have been 70s. Yeah, right? but from but then started the middle 60s and kind of waned down. Two things they say caused the uh, downfall of this as a theme park. Uh -huh. One was Disney. Yes. And one... Where am I going? Come on. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> and one was um, the building of the interstate because... The road that comes through here, Highway 40, uh -huh. was a main road back then. Yeah. And then when they built I-75, oh, everything yeah. changed. <laughs> it did. It did. Uh, people were able to get to the Orlando and Tampa area quicker, so they 
didn't spend the night here in Ocala that much. And there was um, a, lot, a lot of people coming here because of some photographs mm -hmm. that were taken by a man named Bruce Mozart. Yes. And those photographs were underwater in that clear water that is on the other side of this camera. <laughs> yeah. And they were of pretty women. Oh yeah, they were gorgeous. And they were in, they weren't skimpy bathing suits, but they were shapely. You know? Yeah, one one piece and uh, two piece uh, that reflected the the day and the time, but it wasn't just the women that were sitting underneath the water. They were doing action shots under the water. One was cooking. One had a big fish hook to try to catch a fish. Right, uh, right. It, you know, you had mowing a the lawn. Mowing the lawn. That was a guy, actually. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Bruce brought guys in later. <laughs> but, but now here's the thing. Okay, I hear what yeah. Robert is saying, mm -hmm. but. For the women in the audience, you're going to disagree. For the men in the audience, you know what I'm talking about. When men back then looked at those pictures, we should mm -hmm. flash them up in the, we do a B-roll here. I'll <laughs> okay. show you, I'll show you some of the pictures. Okay. But when men back then, you're, you're living in Michigan. Mm -hmm. your, your house is covered in snow. Yeah. And you're looking at these pretty women underwater. Come on. In the newspaper ads or magazine ads. Or wherever. You're going to, yeah. you're going to put down that newspaper. You're going to say to your wife, Let's take a trip to Florida. And yeah. she's going to say, oh, that sounds great. Yeah. <laughs> and you're going to say, yeah, yeah, I just want to go for the uh, weather. But you know the truth. No, for the tropical feel. <laughs> so now, you know, so and, and it, it got to the point, and I'm not making this up. It got to the point when so many people came here looking for mermaids mm -hmm. that they had to put up a sign that said there are no mermaids here. Yeah, that was pretty amazing. And then later on, what did they do? They opened up an attraction. Called Wiki Wachi. And it had... Mermaids. That's right. <laughs> it had mermaids, all thanks to Bruce Mozart and his foresight and his uh, photography. So I really believe that Mr. Mozart, I'll mm -hmm. show his picture. There he is. <laughs> I have to remember to put that in there. Uh, uh, Miss Bruce Mozart, who became a friend of ours, by the way. He's yeah, passed he away did. since then. But yeah, um, he, I, I truly believe that it was his photography mm -hmm. that got the attention of the world to come to this area. I think so, because they filmed uh, Tarzan movies here, uh, Creature from the Black Lagoon, while Bruce was here. And all of that, plus his underwater photos, wouldn't have been able to happen, except Bruce was an inventor, and he invented the underwater camera housing. So then you were able to put the movie cameras, put the still photography cameras in that housing, take it underwater, and get those cool underwater shots. Right. Just as a footnote, there is debate as to whether he invented the underwater camera or not. Mm -hmm. people, underwater camera housing. But people did not come here for that. People <laughs> no. came here for the pictures he took with that. Yes, he did. That's why they came here. Now, it became a very popular destination, so popular mm -hmm. that a second attraction opened up right down the road, and that was called... Six Gun Territory. Six Gun! Can you imagine in yeah. today's world? <laughs> watching people shooting at each other in the street? Yeah, no. Oh that my would gosh, be that's like real news. Yeah, exactly. That would be uncomfortable. But Six Gun Territory had the cowboys. Yeah. They had the heavy hitters, you know. Before that, you say anything else, huh? Robin worked there. <laughs> she was not a can can girl, though. No, 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 no. She I... could have been. Absolutely, could have been. <laughs> No, no, I like the administrative end of it, the marketing yeah, end. Administrative end. Yeah. You still do the <laughs> administrative the accounting end. and all that stuff. But no, Six Gun Territory garnered the attention of all of the Hollywood cowboys that were famous, um, all of the Cartwrights, uh, John the Wayne. The Cartwrights. Every, you know, everybody like that. Is that, that. how come your brother calls Boone, his company Peronto Rosa? I know his last name is Peronto. Yes. But it goes Peronto Rosa. That sounds like the Ponderosa. It does. It does. And it I'm sure that's it. intentional. Sure, it was intentional, <laughs> but it was great. Why and didn't he call it Stud Track? Because he loves <laughs> Star Trek. <laughs> yeah. And he's in a piece of wood a stud. Yes. And and then he could also be a stud. That's right. So and the Cowboys were studs. Jim, you missed a great. You gotta have a second business. <laughs> call it Stud Track. <laughs> there you go. I'm telling you, it's got yeah. the wood. Okay, two bottles here. <laughs> But what was great about uh, Silver Springs and Six Gun Territory is that they were both sister attractions. They weren't owned by the same people, but they each respected each other. They knew each other. And if you were worked at Six Gun Territory, you and your families could come over to Silver Springs and get in for free. 
And if you worked at Silver Springs, you, you and your families could come over to Six Gun Territory and get in for free. And Robin's brother Jim really also nice. worked there. He was a drummer. Yeah, he did. He was a drummer in the Palace Saloon and, <laughs> and also drove the tractor to keep everything, you know, all the grass manicured and he all that He still drives stuff. a tractor. Yeah, he does. But Silver Springs is so beautiful and uh, right. they uh, have the glass bottom boats. I'm going to turn the camera around and show you these, uh, these canoe guys. Okay. Okay. There they are. The canoes. Oh, there's a motorboat there too. You know what's pretty neat? You can actually rent the canoes here. So you don't have to bring your own or the kayaks. You don't have to bring your own. You can rent them here. Where do they rent them, Robin? Right down where they're going? Like where they're heading to? Yeah, on the far side of the, the parking lot. The south side. I wonder how much it costs, you know? Uh, I don't know, but we'll find out. Pretty busy here today. The parking lot was really full. Yeah, it's a Saturday. A lot of people are here picnicking. Uh, we watch the glass bottom boats come in and out, and it's really a beautiful day. All right, so before we get on to the next pictures, there's people picnicking right there, by the way. Yeah. More picnickers. <laughs> <clears throat> and people across the way by the uh, glass bottom boats uh, rocking in the rocking chairs. That's another comfortable place to sit. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Oops. All right, we're doing our second card. Yes, we are. Cards. Oh, look how pretty yours is already. I did, I, this time I didn't do a complimentary layer. I just did uh -huh. straight painting. And I'm kind of doing watercolor-ish. And it looks like you are too. Yeah. Let me see yours. Yeah. Oops, my hand is in the way. You kind of look in the same way I'm looking, I think. Yeah. Same the angle. Yeah, only mine's skinnier. Skinny. Oh, you're doing a, a portrait. I'm doing a portrait a instead portrait. of landscape. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Yeah, I wanted to change it up a little bit. So there's product placement. How <laughs> <laughs> to Coke? Uh oh. Okay, baby. Coca Cola. <laughs> oh, oh, there's more product placement. We had a pickle. <laughs> Those are the best too, Clawson. Now that's a pickle. It is in the refrigerated section. Is that what the ad used to say? No, that's a pickle. I think so. Yeah. Well, look at those guys with those double paddle paddles. Oh yeah, kayakers. Look at that. Those two boats. Did they crash? <laughs> I don't know. I don't think so. Oh okay. Maybe they know each other. They're good friends. <laughs> I hope so. All right, back to the painting job. It's beautiful. Well, thank you, Robert. All right, check-in time. I think I'm done with mine. Oh, yours looks beautiful. And that's that scene across the way there. Oh, that's so gorgeous. Isn't that pretty? And there it is. And Isn't there it pretty? is. And yours is, is which direction? Aim the camera. Uh, right there. Pretty. The big fat one Show with me. the guy in the canoe right there. Right there, okay. Yeah. Right there, okay. Yeah. Nice. So you got like a close-up lens on yours. Yeah, I wanted to do the reflection. That's my favorite part is reflections. I yeah, don't know how good it is, but... That's I how you do it. Squiggles. I just like the reflections. Squiggles. Boy, the, I like the way the, the sun is right now. Look at that angle. Yeah, it's gorgeous. I like that angle. All right, now we are done. We've been sitting here. I don't know how long. Do you know? I... Don't know. Let's see what time is it. Three, four hours. Four hours. Wow. Well, we we left the blood center at two o'clock, and it's now ten minutes to six. Explain the blood center line. Oh yeah, we we went to Life South Community Blood Centers and donated blood today. See, and <laughs> you got a green one. <laughs> I got a green and, one. Uh, yep. So two o'clock we left there and we came here. So let's see if you say two thirty to five thirty is three hours. I would say. All right, so let me yeah. see your finished product. Okay. And th and we I we in the beginning you there said you were gonna do three, one. I was gonna do two, but it's the other way around. Yeah, it took me a while. On this nice. Oh, I like the reflections. See, that's what you were shooting for. Yeah, I was looking for. Did you put coconuts in those trees? <laughs> <laughs> you put coconuts. I did just for the heck of it. <laughs> all right, all right. So then I did a very yours. a very pastelly colored 
And they're really just experimenting with watercolor because I don't know what I'm doing, but <laughs> anyway, there we are. We'll probably walk around with the camera a little bit because I think I want to. Yeah. What time is this place closed? 8.30 p.m. What time is it now? 10 to 6. Oh, okay. We got we time to walk around. and 40 minutes. Oh, so we'll walk around a little bit. But anyway, we got our pictures done. Yeah. And let's, let's put all of them together. Can we do all of them? Sure. I ended up doing three. You did two. Yeah. These are for people. Did we explain this already earlier? In the church that we go to, St. John Lutheran. Lutheran. Church. Is it John's or John? John. St. John Lutheran, Lutheran church. church. Yeah. The pastor and his wife came up with this idea to send cards to people who were sick. It's called the card company. And sometimes people are have to go to an assisted living facility. Sometimes people are a little down. Right. So, well, I'll take a picture of the collection and then we'll put it on. Okay. Back. I like this table. I love the table as a background. Yeah. <laughs> That's nice. Yeah. All right. So there's the cards we did. Can you move your palette and stuff a little to the right? There we go. Sure. All right. Now we've got a nice centered picture of the pictures. And these are going to five people. Yep. Who are needing a little bit of joy. Yeah. They need some joy. And, uh, we enjoy doing this. <laughs> I do. It's it's kind of like yeah. uh, coloring Easter eggs. And it's strictly all volunteer. I mean, we're not the only ones that do this. Uh, people, you know, can do their own way of doing their own greeting cards. So everybody that's on the list gets a multiple amount of greeting cards from different people. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's fun, but it does have its rewarding element, too. Yeah. All right. Let's turn this off. Clean up and then let's take a walk. Okay. All right. Well, we had a good time at Silver Springs. Did I say we oh. were going to take a walk? <laughs> yeah. Well, we didn't. Well, that's okay. We've been sitting there painting, so that's all right. Well, you that's know, good we, enough for me. All right. We, we sat yeah. there, what, you say three hours? Uh, three and a half hours. Yeah. Hey, you don't realize yeah. sitting is a lot of work. <laughs> it is. <laughs> when I got up, I, my legs didn't want to go anywhere. So. Yeah. I, I wimped out on Robin. I said, uh, do you mind if we don't walk? So we're not walking. No, no, that's okay. But we're enjoying this beautiful fountain at Silver Springs. So we had a good time in Silver Springs. We had mm -hmm. a good time making the cards. It's a nice thing to think about. You know, somebody gets a card and says something nice inside of it. We both write in all of our cards. So the cards Robin painted and the cards I painted both have messages from both of us. Yeah, so. and then we give the individual artist credit on the back. Like the individual <laughs> artist. Like they, well, like they do at Hallmark, you know. But <laughs> let me tell you something. Robin has a list of people who are going to get these five cards. We're yes. going to pick them out at random. Mm -hmm. And also, there's something about each person. Like, are they needing cheering up? Are they needing prayer? Are they... Have they just moved to an assisted living facility? Do they have an ingrown you know, toenail? Uh, stuff like that. Or maybe <laughs> they want seconds. <laughs> seconds? I'm glad you said seconds. I'm food, yeah. Uh, the first syllable sounded like something else was going to happen out of your mouth. <laughs> they wanted seconds. <laughs> they wanted some seconds. Well, you know. <laughs> they wanted some old. seconds. <laughs> All right. See you later. Take care. Be good. <laughs> Don't forget to write. Remember, writing is very important. And... The Once world, again, <laughs> the world spins fine on her own. Yeah. Baby. The world spins fine on her own. Yeah. The world spins fine.